Thanks, Joe. The state's auditor general says not enough is being done on the national level to prepare for the impacts of climate change. Now he's urging Pennsylvania officials to take action. Matt Heckel tells us how from Harrisburg. Yeah, well, today, the third of three hearings on the impacts of climate change was held at Widener University's Commonwealth Law School in Harrisburg, where experts talked about some of the impacts that are already being seen and what can be done. Climate change has led to increased human health risks from air pollution, diminished water quality, heat stress, exacerbated asthma, and increased waterborne illnesses. Pennsylvania Health Secretary Dr. Rachel Levine spoke at Monday's hearing about the health impacts being seen by climate change, like milder winters leading to more ticks and thus a rise in things like Lyme disease and West Nile virus. Health impacts from climate change are expected to cause approximately 250,000 additional deaths throughout the world each year. Officials also talked about the economic impact of climate change with things like increased flood damage coming at a cost to the state. PennDOT has to take a big chunk of their money that should be going to you know, fix roads and bridges, but dealing with mudslides because of these severe storms. A lot of the severe flooding, that has a huge economic toll along with the human cost. Monday's hearing was the last of three Auditor General Eugene De Pasquale has held on the impacts of climate change on the state. He's now working to put out a plan of action to prepare for those impacts. I want to see what Pennsylvania specifically can do to try to mitigate some of these economic costs. And the Auditor General's special report is expected to be completed this summer. In Harrisburg, I'm Matt Heckel, WTHA News.